One of the most hotly debated topics within the fitness industry is training frequency. More specifically, how often you should train each muscle group per week. On one end of the spectrum, you have those who advocate a training frequency of just one time per week, whereas others favor a higher frequency approach. For example, a 2013 survey of 127 competitive bodybuilders found that 69% of respondents trained each muscle group once per week, while the remaining 31% trained muscles twice or more weekly. So while it's evident that you will see results regardless of what training frequency you use, the question now though is what's optimal? And to figure that out, we need to look at the research. Luckily, researcher Brad Schoenfeld recently published a 2016 meta-analysis on this exact topic. They collected 10 different studies and compared training each muscle one time per week versus training each muscle with higher frequencies of two or three times per week, and analyzed the effect it had on muscle growth. The result, as shown here, every single study showed a benefit to training with higher frequencies. In fact, training each muscle two or three times per week resulted in 3.1% greater muscle growth than training each muscle just once per week. And since total workout volume, exercises, and rest times were equated for all the studies included in this analysis, it's very likely that the difference in training frequency is indeed what caused that extra 3.1% muscle growth muscle growth. Which, just to put this 3.1% number in perspective, could result in roughly an extra pound of muscle gain for a beginner after their first year of training. Which may not sound like a lot, but definitely would be a noticeable difference. So based on this, we know at the very least that training each muscle a minimum of two days a week is needed to maximize muscle growth. As for whether or not frequencies higher than this would be beneficial, it's relatively unclear at the moment. However, it does seem as if more may not not be better. For example, this recent 2017 paper compared training each muscle two days per week versus four days per week, with weekly volume being equated between groups. The researchers found that after just six weeks, the two times per week training frequency group experienced greater upper body gains than the four times per week group, therefore indicating that sticking to training each muscle group around two times per week is probably your best bet. Now as for the reasoning behind this, it likely has to do with something called muscle protein synthesis, which is essentially the process your muscle goes through after a workout in order to build additional muscle mass. And based on the literature, we know that after a resistance training workout, protein synthesis remains elevated for roughly 36 to 48 hours in most individuals. So if you were to train each muscle group just one time per week, you can see how you wouldn't be optimizing the protein synthesis response by not stimulating the growth process as frequently as you could be throughout the week. Whereas if you were to train each muscle group too frequently, you would be interfering with the recovery process. So by sticking to training each muscle group two to three times per week, for example, you're able to maximize the protein synthesis response throughout the week while avoiding any interference with recovery given that you're volume per session is not excessive. But even with this theory, and as with many things within this field, there are also a lot of unknowns that research is yet to iron out. For instance, this very recent 2018 study by Gentle and colleagues actually found that when trained subjects who were previously using a two times per week muscle training frequency for at least four months switched over to a one time per week bro split protocol, they actually saw significantly greater muscle growth over 10 weeks when compared to another group that simply stayed with the two times per week muscle training frequency throughout the study. Now, to be honest, this wasn't the best designed study and is yet to be replicated, but nonetheless, it does provide the notion that for well-trained lifters at least, switching it up every now and then might provide a beneficial response and is something to keep in mind and possibly experiment with. However, for most of you, I think it's best to stick with the following recommendations since they're based on a solid amount of research. We know that training in muscle group two to three times per week is superior to one times per week. And we know that training at frequencies greater than this doesn't seem to provide an added benefit unless you're aiming to improve a specific lift, for example. 
Therefore, for the majority, you'd ideally want to use a workout split that accomplishes a two or three times per week training frequency while enabling you to get in the adequate volume of 10 plus weekly sets per muscle group as discussed in my interview with researcher Brad Schoenfeld. And you can do so with a variety of workout splits, but here's a three day, four day, five day, and six day split that are all good options to do so. But with all of that being said, it's total weekly volume and adherence to your routine that are the more important factors when it comes to long-term progress. So if you find that a one time per week training split or something other than what was discussed is more enjoyable for you and is something you'll be more consistent with, then that's what I'd stick with. But overall, for the majority, sticking to the recommendations outlined earlier would likely be the best approach. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. I just wanted to really quickly remind you guys that my programs are now live, but will be closing very soon at 11.59 p.m. tomorrow, August 30th, and then won't reopen again for several weeks after that. So if you're interested in getting in with group one, then simply head on over to builtwithscience.com forward slash courses to sign up before it closes. And just to clarify, if you join now, you get lifetime access to everything and anything within the program, as well as access to the private Built With Science Facebook group, which is a community for group one that I'll be moderating to help everyone throughout the weeks. And it's honestly just already grown into such a positive environment of individuals helping and motivating each other to reach their goals. The feedback I've received from my programs has already been amazing and I just want to thank each and every one of you who put their trust in me and joined one of my courses. Anyways, fun fact, today is actually my birthday and I just wanted to tell you all how grateful I am for your support. All the positivity you guys show me in the comments and my messages and just everywhere really is humbling and makes everything worth it. It's crazy to see how much my life has changed just in the past year and it's all thanks to you guys so thank you so much, seriously. But that's it for today everyone don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already i'm gonna try my best today to just relax and eat some good food and i'll see you next time